Well, 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 another day, another edition of Entertainment News on Africa's best station, Channels Television. I am Mayawa Ogundele, and it's a pleasure to have you join me on the show. Today, you get to see a special feature on Wale Shoyinka's beautification of Area Boy. We also have up-and-coming singer Simi talking about a new song, Jam Question. Plus, you get to see what new and interesting stories are in Nigeria's entertainment circle. Today's show is packed, and I'll offload in a bit. Wale Shoyinka is a master of his craft, and not even age can deter him from expressing his creativity. Right now, let's show you how the Nobel laureate staged the play titled Beautification of Area Boy. Wale Yinka's 1996 play, The Beautification of the Area Boy came alive in Lagos, southwest Nigeria, at the ongoing Black Heritage Festival in the state. The critically acclaimed play, which has graced many stages across the world, is set in post-colonial Nigeria amid scenes of everyday racketeering and general disquiet. In lead is fast-rising screen actor Wali Ojo, who plays the character Soda, a university dropout who ends up as a security guard, but also runs an underground syndicate of street thieves and pranksters. Stay around the neighborhood today. The relations will be coming and going. All you to oversee the arrangements. They are bound to be in a generous mood. I'm around there. Ah, books. I think we can give you some shower, shower with you. I did this play 20 years ago with, 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 uh, with Professor Shoinka and, and so it was really interesting to uh, relieve the play again 20 years later, although now I'm playing a different character. 20 years ago I played the judge and the colonel, uh, but now I'm playing a Sonda. I try to be fair to all, give them all a fair share of the pottery. And let's see, uh, just you and you, just two will do. As you see, Madame has brought her own maid, so your job is to follow her, make sure no one snatches her purse, okay? and you carry anything that she or her maid wants you to carry and you see her to the car. Oh, I think it's a, your car is being looked after. Oh, but of course, we'll have come with a driver. No, I beg pardon, madam. Chauffeur. <laughs> well, there it is in action. No sweat at all. Uh, like a street sociologist, he's a very well-educated guy who lives amongst the lower classes and um, he, uh, he tries to um, contribute what he can. He's like a Robin Hood figure. He steals from the rich and he gives it to the poor. The city is all the better for it. Uh, nothing like starting a new day on a clean slip. Another character of interest is Judge, a mentally disturbed man really, but who'd once been a lawyer. He can be referred to as a cat with nine lives because he's had two brushes with death in a day, but escaped luckily. He comes to the realization that justice is not won through the law, but through the paths of mercy. The beatification of the era boy is a satire of some sort that provides insight you know into what life was in the 60s and the 70s during the military era and it's somewhat sad you know that some of the issues that have been articulated in the play are still very much around with us you know which you know is a sad commentary of on where we are as a country you know if then comes Mishei, a former university colleague of sonda who at first is shocked and disgusted on seeing Sonda at his security job post and is quick to condemn him. Hey, Mr. Slum Artist, 
street sociologist. We just got to start if we just speak the same language. I said, you are nothing but a shadow. A poser. Master the other class to which you don't belong. You are just evil, you know that? Honestly, those things are definitely the living because they have no other way of earning a living. But you scrap for the same stuff with them, don't you? So who are you to preach anything? But all you do is waste the training you are given. On finding out the reason behind it though, she gladly joins forces with him. Misha Yi later shuns her fiancé to marry Sonda. We will diversify the right music for the right occasion. Hey, maybe you will pick up the old side of God, eh? And join the band. The real one will be with tomorrow. Not just that tomorrow, but the tomorrow all around us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The eternal nightmare of the tomorrow which one waits up. Uh, this is the first time I'm seeing a, a play directed by Shoenka. I know I've read it before, I've read his plays, you know, so, but I, I've never watched a play that he directed, so it was quite interesting for me. What a play was an experience. Um, the multiple stages, the large cast, you know, social commentary, all these Shoenka um, themes, you know, came, came together, yeah. The play, which was directed by Wally Shoenka himself, cleverly draws the audience in as it changes sets at intervals, forcing the audience to move with it. Showing Cap paints a different picture of the street urchins, otherwise known as area boys in Nigeria. Where society generally views them as a group of never-do-wells, showing car portrays them here as a set of people who are as responsible as the next person and are only busy going about the business of survival. <laughs> Very quickly, let's see what new stories are in the entertainment circle.